helping to honor those who died for our freedom by making sure a memorial for World War II veterans is not forgotten. News Watch 16's Christina Papa was there for the rededication ceremony in Lewisburg. Sarah Mahoney is used to thanking veterans for their service, but on this Memorial Day, a day meant to honor those who have died for our freedom, veterans are thanking her. Boy, I'll tell you, a young girl like you taking the interest in what we have here, oh gosh, that's great. Veterans, Girl Scouts, and community members met outside Lewisburg Area High School for a special Memorial Day and rededication ceremony. It's a culmination of Mahoney's Girl Scout Gold Award Project, the highest honor a Girl Scout can achieve. It requires Girl Scouts to change the world or at least their little part of it. With veterans and her family, Mahoney says she wanted to raise awareness for those who have fought for our country. And I found out that this memorial was at the old high school building, but when they built the new school, it was still at the old building and it was in the deeds of the school to move it, but. It hadn't been moved yet. With help from the district, Mahoney raised support and worked to coordinate the move. Now, this veterans memorial dedicated to those who served in World War II sits beside the new school. It's been 72 years to the day since the first dedication ceremony and veterans from World War II who were there back in the 1940s were able to come back for the ceremony on Memorial Day. Yeah, it's a great privilege anyway to, to be here and talk about that. Albert has served in the Navy during World War II. Now 92 years old, the veteran has fond memories of the first dedication ceremony. And as you look back now, it was wonderful. And uh, something that I'll always remember. This project is all about the veterans, and what I really want to do is just thank these veterans for all that they have done for our country. And because of her project, others will be able to do just that in years to come. Krista Papa, Newswatch 16, Union County.